Welcome back, you guys. This is Tessendra, continuing my CK2 campaign, where we hope to take back the Kingdom of Delhi. Well, that's kind of a long title, but now I'm working on it. So, I'm going to wait until these two wars are over, and then we're just going to swear fealty. There's just no way around that. Stop scheming. Thank you. So, who are these wars again? This guy... Is it war with... Uh... Well, I'm allied to this guy, I know that. He's got quite a lot of dudes. And you have what? Oh, you have quite a lot of dudes as well. Interesting. Interesting. But uh, I kind of need my man right now. Once I'm a part of the Tibetan Kingdom, I can declare on this guy, I think, instantly. Who was this guy? You're allied to him. He's got 3,000 men as well. Now this guy has cancer. Well, so if he dies, that alliances are kaput. All of his siblings are dead. What is this symbol here? Oh, come on, go away. Left their old life behind to travel to the Chinese Empire? Okay. Interesting. Yeah, all of this goes to my sons. Is there any way to send some of them away? Okay, I'll study some more, get me some more karma. I have a lot of prestige. Scarred. Yeah, but most of that is just from uh, my kingdom stuff. So how is this war here? You appear to be fighting this guy as well. So I'm helping this guy with two wars? Interesting. I don't really feel like helping him, but okay. Uh, visiting the monastery at which my order has convened this time, I join my fellow lay members in dutiful performing all tasks required of us. Okay. In the evening, after the day's hard work, the abbot gathers all the visiting lay members and reveals the monastery's great treasure, a great relic that has been safeguarded here for many generations. I might gain... I might lose ambitious. I don't want to lose ambitious. So this will make everybody like me more. And start planning the theft of... Oh yeah, I'm taking that. Maybe I can get it just for money, but uh, I don't want to leave the order. If I can take it without leaving the order, that would be nice. And build a temple. How's that coming along? Oh, it's going to be ready this year. Uh, oh yeah, this is the study. Study, study stuff. Oh. Having decided that the relic would be much better safeguarded in my own hands, I must now tackle the task of how to liberate it from the confines of the monastery. I can think of a few different paths to take. Uh, though bold and simple, simply waiting for nobody to be looking and then running as fast as possible is not likely to result in success. <laughs> Bribe the abbot. 620 gold? Fuck it, I'm grabbing it and running. Wait, wait, I'm doing a mission to build a temple and I paid a lot of money for this. Hopefully everything works out. Did I get the... Ah, uh, no, I did not get it. It was some kind of bone. Deep in the night, uh, I've snuck down to the relic chamber Adrenaline pumps through my veins as I take hold of the priceless artifact, savoring the feeling of it in my hand. But suddenly I hear the sound of footsteps and I turn around to find Shatra Shahui looking at me with wide eyes. Use the surprise to make a break for it. Uh, this will end my time. Oh, so I leave the order. You seem evenly matched. Do I try to kill him? I 
I kind of like that idea. Come on. Kill him. No! <laughs> no, I died. No. Fuck. So what do I have now? I have... Huh. So I have this one. This one. This one. And then the duchy. Okay, so I lost... Quite a lot of holdings. Fuck. Hmm. Well, let's try to get some of them back at least. Shit! Why did I die? That's so unfair. And the temple is almost gonna be built. Man. Rival. Really? I can't kill you. Pick character focus. Well, I think I'll make this guy kind of high intrigue. Let's go intrigue. And let's have groom and heir. And let's take some concubines if we can. Um, no, I guess I'll take these two. There we go. Choose a patron deity. I don't have a, yeah, I do. I can just, just. Appoint somebody. I don't have to spend money on that. Spy master. There you go. And advisor gonna be you. There we go. I don't like the fact that my rival is a marshal. She was a patron deity. Uh, give me intrigue. At the cost of stewardship, maybe? Oh yeah, that's the only option. If I want Intrigue, I'm going to have to sacrifice some stewardship. Alright. I can press a weak claim. Oh, she might fancy me. Why not? Why not? I also want to spy on this guy. Oh, I gave her a good tumble. Yeah, that's what I want to see. So, uh, this war, can it end? I want to swear fealty right now. You have a lot of bastards here. My name is what? Son Paul II. Son Paul Jadeva. Wait, I'm the second one there? It is! So, if I kill these two people, I'll get the Kingdom of Punjab. Really? Huh. I'm gonna cancel this. I really want this guy to die, though. White Peace. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to swear fealty to you, if you don't mind. He accepts. And hey, we're to bet right now. You have 3,000 men and a pact for 3,000 more. I kind of need this guy to die. So I'm going to stop spying on you. And I'm going to start spying on this guy. Maybe I can get a kill, easy kill there. What is this? Oh, I have a. Oh, I finished building the temple. There we go. There we go. So Tibet is very, very huge. No, I'm sure he's up to something. 
I just want the opportunity to kill him. Oh! I'm gonna be an advisor in his court. Kind of like that idea. And am I still the heir here? Uh, Son Paul, yeah. Wonderful. I'm gonna clear off all of my messages here. So, is there any way to boost this up a bit more? Sexual preferences. Inform his liege. Uh, he will be publicly denounced and humiliated. Does that mean more people will join my plot to kill him? Yes, it does. Or? What's this? Oh, I'm gonna try to steal it again. And I gained ambitious. Hopefully I don't die again. Who is my heir if I die? My half-brother. Uh, build a temple? Well, fuck off. No, I already built one. Play a trick on anybody. This is because I have high intrigue. Sure. Let's see if that works. Come on, I want that relic. Oh, Jewel Danda. My plan went flawlessly. Not a single soul saw or heard me during the night. And it was not ere daybreak that the theft was discovered. Nobody suspected it was I. Jeweled Danda. National tax modifier? Really? Prestige and diplomacy. Man. So is active when I publicly practice a religion in the Eastern group. Okay. Interesting. Send a eunuch. Sure. Send artifact. I could send him the jewel danda and gave 500. Thank you. So send artifact. I could send this for 500 grades, but that's not enough. Who declared this war? No longer valid. So it ended immediately. Wait, what? We're at war with this guy. Okay, so there's just a bunch of wars that my liege started. So I'm not involved in that. But I need this guy to die. Can we kill him? Inconclusively ended. Well, stop declaring wars that you can't declare. You're 51 years old. Your health has been dropped by three. Successful treatment. You have cancer, dude. I approve, sure. Hmm. So how many, how much of an army do I have now? 2,500. Okay. What? He will owe me a favor. Decline. I hate you. I want you dead. I want my kingdom back. Hmm. 
Uh, I'm spying on him and I'm trying to kill him. Why is nothing working here? Okay, do I just throw money at the problem? Ah, oh, it's so, so small. Wait, I can actually bribe my leash, but he only offers 3%? Let's just arrange this by plot power. You will give me 14% for almost no money there. You will give me... Oh, you're too expensive, man. You... Why are you so expensive, dudes? What the fuck? And why aren't they joining the plot? I'm auto-inviting them, aren't I? Yes, invite the plot. Uh, news from China. What's going on? Um, so more tributaries. Okay. Um, I guess. Kowtow before the Emperor. Hmm. So he's got four kids, two daughters and two kids, uh, two sons. I really need this guy to die. I need him to die so I can do some stuff. And how long have you guys been moving? I want my fucking kingdom back. Uh, peasant revolt against the guy in Tibet. There's, there's a lot of problems in Tibet. They're kind of big. And I think that's a huge problem. Look, I threw some money around here. Why aren't more people wanting to join this? No, I'm not going to give you that much money. Uh, a rumor. Artifact hidden. Sure. Let's send the spy master. Why not? See, normally I would just declare on this guy, but I don't want him and his pact here. I wish I could just click on this and see who the people are that are allied here. Uh, me and... Yes. Give me gold. I got some decent prestige. She is the genius. Sweet. Okay. Designated regent. Uh, let's see. Content people. There's a mayor here. Uh, I'm going to make stuff up. He likes to dress up as a woman. Ha ha ha. Maybe... He gets less liked this way, and hopefully more people will uh, want to join my plot here. There you go. Oh, 120 gold. No. Well, invite to plot. Why isn't this working? Forty-three ducats. God damn it. This is just too expensive. We're up to 85. Hmm. Apostate was found. Just a normal dude. Just burn him. What is this? Falsify... Falsely confess faith. What? Confess to your leash's faith for political reasons while still practicing your true faith in private. Ah. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. No, 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 no. I'm going to wait with that. I just got an opportunity to maybe kill him. Five gold. 
Come on. Please? Please work. Uh, yes. My complicity is known, but he's dead now. He's got a son with no pact and 3,000 levy. Well, I can afford to hire some mercenaries. I don't think he can. Let's declare war. Claim Delhi. No, no, no. My claim is this color here, this flag. I have a claim on it, don't I? Weak claim on the Kingdom of Delhi. So I can't press it because it's weak. Is this for the whole kingdom? Um, my half-brother. Half-brother, half-brother, half-brother. I keep forgetting my name here. Son Paul the Second. Here we go. Matihara Son Paul the Second of the Jadada Kingdom gains the Kingdom of Delhi. Yep. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna raise, raise, and raise, and we're gonna hire some mercenaries. Hmm. No calf. I need some calf. There we go. There we go. We are at war for our kingdom of Delhi. Uh, falsely confess faith. Sure. Praise Brahma. But not really. This will make him like me a bit more. Okay. What about you, my friend? You appear to be at war. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. So I guess that didn't work out. I forget what I was. Yeah. Shakrist? I don't know. I think I fucked up there. I lost my place in society. In that society. Okay. Let's go. I'm leading the flank. That could be bad. Is there nothing else I can do here? Um, okay. There we go. Fine. Fine. Oh, a concubine is pregnant. So they don't have full morale. This should be a stomping. My other concubine is pregnant. We just apparently brought our concubines along with us for war. Or no, no, they're pregnant. They might have been a while ago. There we go. Crush him. We killed a mayor of some place. Okay, how much casualties did we inflict on these guys here? 2,000. Well, good. We're going to do one more fight. And then we're going to seed down my former capital. It will be so good to be back. There we go. Maybe I should continue softening them up a bit more. I don't want them to get any ideas and start seating down other shit. Uh, we're not doing a lot of casualties here. Why is that? We do have quite a lot of calf. We should be able to do a lot in the pursuit phase. But we're only getting like 200 every time.
Come on, get him. So, this is like six more times, apparently. Hmm. Okay. Spy Master wants to do something. Oh, I'm technically losing some money here. So let's continue these fights a bit, and then we'll assault the fortresses to spend my mercenaries, hopefully. Mm -hmm. Choose a patron deity. Give me intrigue. And I'm gonna move this out. I don't want to do this. That was a big mistake. And I now have a prisoner. I'm just gonna execute him. Make him disappear. Okay. Now we just assault this. And boom. There we go. We keep assaulting because we have mercenaries and they're expensive. Son Paul, the third. Nice. We're getting a whole bunch of prisoners. Wait, are we seating down the trade post? No, 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 no. We're not going to sack that. Make him disappear. But apparently, we got a lot of prisoners. We'll have to take a look at that later. Oh, thank you. King God. So we're up to 86. We're now at 98. So I think we'll just one more fight and then we can end this war. And my kingdom will be returned to me. There we go. What? We're stuck at 98? Do I really have to seat some more stuff down then? There's a chance I gain wounded. Don't do that. Am I wounded? No. He was splashing soap. The idiot. Come on. And we got 100%. Oh my god. We have our kingdom back. But I need to revoke this from him. And since we have a claim on it, our vassals will not object. He says maybe? Aw oh, man, he rose up again. The idiot. You have no troops? So I'm gonna take his uh, duchy away from him. As soon as I can. Open council position. Advisor. Sure. We'll have to fix that stuff later, though. Dangerous faction. Already. My rival. It's considered tyrannical. Well, let's spy on him then. Okay, come on. This war is over. Why don't you end it? I have righteous imprisonment on this guy. Uh, where is he again? Huh. He is in... He's in my court. Okay, what if I have you suppress revolts here? Huh. What if I fire you from the council? And then I just 
try to imprison you. There we go. There goes the faction then. Can I demand his religious conversion? Maybe. Hey, my wife is pregnant. Awesome. We could just assault this, right? I mean, we just butchered this before. So we're at 33%. What is this? Sure. But anyway, we got our kingdom back. And we got our trade post. Oh, I'm gonna take this all from you, man. I want my stuff. What? What? You forced my sister to become your concubine? Well, it's a half-sister, but still. I hate when people do that to me. I'm gonna do that to somebody else. I have some prisoners. So, uh, I have a 22-year-old and a 24-year-old concubine here. Uh, 33. My rival? She's five years old. Okay. Well, it will make people not like me, but it's fine. Queen Mother. That's an elephant. That's an elephant. Oh man, the elephant one is always so bad. Okay, can we take this, please? We are running out of time here. And is there a way to make, like, my primary title? There we go. Kingdom of Delhi, make primary. Yeah, that's what I want. We're not gonna siege down the trade post, okay? Where's he going? He's going to Hisar. There we go. I've already sieged down your, like, the main holding here. Do I really have to siege down everything else as well? Hmm. So if I wipe out your army, that's not enough? Apparently not. But this levy has been depleted, so there's just 600 dudes here. Let's just siege this down. And let's go to speed 4. Oh, I got a daughter. With my genius wife, but she did not get genius. Unfortunately. But I'm so happy we got our we got the kingdom of Delhi back. And if I kill this guy now and his son and burn him. I inherited something? Oh, yes. Thank you. Okay, he offered me condolences because somebody died. Interesting. Really? Okay, just just burn it down, would you? Ah, maybe I should not. Expose him. Hmm. I want everything in here. I have enough domain size for it and I'm going to do it. Blackmail the vassal? No, 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 no. 
I'm not gonna do anything for now. I might have to sort out my kingdom yet. I haven't done that yet. We we need to do a lot of stuff first. Okay, 100% and enforce demands. Okay, good. So let's revoke titles. Uh huh. Revoke title. Uh huh. Revoke titles. Revoke titles. Okay, so he's gonna keep a barony, but all of this is mine now. I have two duchies and two kingdoms. Awesome, you guys! We got our kingdom of Delhi back! We had to swear fealty to the bet, but we got it back. So, I'm gonna stop here. I will see you guys in the next episode, but until then, see ya.